15 years on the job, Father, and things haven't changed. It doesn't matter how many thieves I put behind bars, Father, they, they keep on popping up. I'm just trying to make the world a, a better place, you know, a more peaceful world. God's world, Father. I haven't asked any favours from the Lord. It was you, Father, who gave my little girl her first communion. It was you, Father, who believed in me when I went through those crazy and tough times in the police force. I thank you for that. We've been uh, searching for this uh, criminal almost three years now. I mean, she's great at her craft, Father, but she needs to be stopped. If she's not stopped, the fine line between good and evil is going to become very blurred. People are starting to talk about her, Father. They're saying she's some sort of a saint, some sort of a hero stealing from the rich and giving to the poor. It's these type of people who inspire more evil actions in the world. Now, tonight there's going to be a showcase. Our girl's going to be there tonight. And from information received, Father, she's going to steal the lot. What exactly do you need from me? I want you to pray for me, Father. I want you to pray for the world so that this criminal is brought to justice. That's all I ask for. Three years ago, when I asked you to serve the community, this isn't what I was talking about. Father, it's not stealing. I'm simply taking back what's rightfully theirs. Look, the world right now is a screwed up place. Those greedy sinners are sucking humanity dry whilst leaving the rest to rot to death. Soup kitchens aren't going to save lives. God has given me a mission to create a world where we are all equal. And I intend on making this a reality. Please, Father. Thank you. Father, if I don't do this, people will suffer.